Hi there, um, this is Martin from PhoneJar and we are just giving you a short demo video of how to use two phone joys with Blue's IME. Well, first you need to pair both of your phone joys. You do that in the uh, Bluetooth settings. And you need to turn on your first phone joy and scan for devices in the Bluetooth settings. And there we go, phone joy, you tap on it. And you just enter your phone joy pin like usual, one, two, three, four. There we go, it's paired. And now we need to rename it. In this case, uh, to keep it simple, we just rename it to PhoneJoy1. Okay, and now we can turn on the second PhoneJoy to pair it also on the Bluetooth settings. So we scan for devices again, and we select PhoneJoy. And just like the other one, we enter our pin 1234. So it's all very straightforward and easy actually. And we rename it again, a different name of the first one, in this case PhoneJoy2. This will actually make it easier for Blue's IME to distinguish both controllers. Because if they have the same name, there are usually connectivity problems. So there you go, PhoneJoy1, PhoneJoy2, both paired and connected. And now we need to go to the Blue's IME settings to configure both controllers. Um, for better demonstration purposes, we have the default settings of Blue's IME here. So nothing is set up prior. So we need to set the number of controllers. You can't really see it here, but we set it to two. There we go. And now we have two devices listed. Um, no device has been selected yet. And we select PhoneJoy 1 and driver will be PhoneJoy of course and now device 2 we select PhoneJoy 2 and the same as the first one we select the PhoneJoy driver okay there you go PhoneJoy 1 and PhoneJoy 2 both selected and for the next step we need to activate Blue's IME if you haven't done so already um, you can do that in the keyboard settings um, you just tap on select IME while you turn on both of your phone joys, but you can also do it later. Okay, so we activate Blue's IME and we can go back to Blue's IME. And now we just need to select it. There we go, and now Blue's IME should start to connect your phone joys. Make sure that both of them are turned on. And there we go, the first one has already connected successfully. And the second one is still taking some time. Or well, sometimes you just need to push some buttons to send like a signal to your tablet or phone, whatever you're using. And there we go, that's connected too. So both phone joys have been connected now, and you can use it with your emulator or app, whatever you want to use two controllers for. You can also use four if you want to, it's totally up to you. And there you can see it, you can use the D-pads, perfectly fine, no problems whatsoever. Well, that was just our short demo video. If you have any problems, just drop us an email at support at phonejoy.us.